Most any pedal with a round shaft and a flat spot under the spring arm is compatible with the torque adjustable quick torque cam. Even simpler pedals like this Gibraltar can benefit from using this high torque system. Though your pedal may be different in brand or style, spring assemblies are all very much the same. Start by loosening your spring tension. Next, remove any wires or clips off the spring. For this, you may need some pliers and a little patience. Next, remove the spring arm from your pedal. Most are held on with a set screw and some may also have a spacer molded onto the back of the arm to hold the bearing in place. Once you remove the spring arm, install any of the spacers included to hold between the bearing and the quick torque cam. Align the cam with the spring and tighten the quick torque cam down onto the flat spot on the drive shaft. When tightening the set screw, rock the cam back and forth while holding the shaft to be sure to tighten securely to the flat spot. Once the cam is secure, then torque the set screw down tightly. Next, reattach the spring to the spring wire on the quick torque cam and pull it down until it's tight. You can now check to see if you like the beater angle or if it needs to be adjusted. The adjustment for this rest position is the screw and clip at the top of the quick torque cam. To change this angle, loosen the screw and move the clip back and forth to change the angle. To shorten the angle, slide the clip forward, and to lengthen the angle, slide the clip back. When you find the angle you like, retighten the screw. The screw on the face of the quick torque cam is the torque adjustment. When playing using the quick torque cam, you'll find you may actually require less overall spring tension. The adjustable torque setting for the quick torque cam makes the pedal more efficient so when in doubt, use less overall spring tension. To adjust the torque setting, remove the spring, then use the screw on the face of the quick torque cam to adjust its position in the slot. Move the cam in for less torque or out for more torque. You'll need to experiment to find the setting that best fits your style, but once you find it, you can set it and forget it. Once you've found your cam setting, tighten the set screw, reattach the spring to the cam, check the beater angle, and tighten up the spring. Well, that's it. You're converted. That is, unless you have a double pedal which has a second spring on the left side. In that case, you'll have ordered a double pedal package which comes complete with a right cam like the one we've just installed and a mirror image left cam for the opposite side of the pedal. The left cams are marked and when installed properly have the arm of the cam toward the heel of the pedal. To convert the left arm on a double pedal, follow the same steps as changing the right arm. Again, the quick torque cam you mount to the left side of the pedal is marked as left and when installed properly has the adjustable arm toward the heel of the pedal. After playing a few sets, please be sure to check the set screw to make sure it is firmly tightened to the drive shaft. So okay, that's it. Play loud, play tight, play often.